reaction of this if you have CH3 OH OH CH3 and you have taken HIO4 so it will break this bond carbon carbon bond and when you break the carbon carbon bond one OH will attach here and one OH will attach here and product will form CH3 CH having OH and OH from here one water molecule will convert it water molecule will release and it will form CH3 C double bond O H yes or no and how many moles so both are symmetrical two so what is the role of HIO4 it will break the carbon carbon bond if there are two adjacent carbon and both have OH carbonyl or acid or acid derivative then that carbon will oxidize yes or no so HIO4 break this carbon carbon bond and add to OH group in case of diol both OH group must be seen then reaction occur if you want to make reaction of this HIO4 see both are seen or not both are seen both are same side then reaction occur if both are anti then reaction does not occur so here both OH are anti therefore no oxidation reaction but here both are same side because here ester can't form I can't rotate here because it is a closed chain if it is open chain then rotation possible but in closed chain you can't rotate so on this there is no reaction because the intermediate will not form intermediate is the ester is the intermediate ester of iodine is the intermediate which will not form in this and here it is seen therefore reaction occur and in reaction you know that you have to break this carbon bond and you have to add two OH group one here and one here so we must write in dotted so what will be the product so add this carbon 2 OH and 2 OH so as you know that one water molecule from here and one water molecule from here so what will form if you remove minus 2 H2O it will form that is aldehyde and aldehyde got it got it if there is a closed chain then rotation is restricted but in open chain rotation is not restricted clear so in open chain it is either seen or anti both reaction will occur but while in closed chain it must be seen got it so the see the other example any adjacent carbon all have the oxygen therefore you can break that and the product will form so see here first you have to break this and add one OH here and one OH here then also you break this no because it is not the alcohol carbonyl compound here is no sin and NT, sp2 hybridization in sp2 there is no sin and NT. and uh, in open chain there is no sin and NT because it can rotate all bonds see here all has oh 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 so all bond will break all bond will break all bond will break and you have to write oh on each see here 
when you break one bond, always one wedge on both. So see here, at this carbon, one H, one C, no, one O H. What is this? Formic acid. Yes or no? H C double bond O O H. And on this carbon, how many O H? Three O H. So, from one carbon, H C double bond. Sorry, C O H. O H and O H. And from here, tell me, one water molecule will release and what will form H C double bond O H and see here this carbon has also 3 O H this is also 1 2 3 this is also 1 2 3 this is only 2 so from 2 so how many this 1 2 3 4 so it will be the 4 plus so one is formic acid other is the see here this is also formic acid so how many formic acids so total 5 mole of formic acid and plus see here yes yeah, so h h o h and o h and one water molecule will release here and it will form h c double bond o h so got it so five mole of formic acid and one mole of formaldehyde so this will the product so all at the same carbon range O H O O O O O O. So if there is a O on at the same carbon, you have to break that bond. So you have to break all bonds. Yes or no? And for each bond, two you have to add two O H group on both carbon, each on both carbon. So here one O H will be. So, one OH here and one OH here. On each carbon, see here, here is only one. So, at first carbon, two OH group. So what? When CH2, one OH and one OH. So two OH. But it will be converted in, you have to remove one water molecule. So HC double bond, OH. And see here, uh, this carbon has also two OH. So this carbon and this carbon both will give. So how many? Two. What about this? At this carbon, there is two OH group. So see here. C double bond O, OH, and OH. From here, water will release and form CO2. And what about this carbon? This carbon has three OH. This carbon has also three OH. This has also three OH. So three carbon has three OH, and tell me if any carbon has three OH, so what will the product? So you remove one water molecule, and it will form HC double bond O H, and this will be the three. So three, two, one, six. So got it? So how many different products? Three different products. Formaldehyde, CO2 and formic acid. Mm -hmm.